Hi, this is Donna Reiners, and I'm thinking about you today. And today I have Michelle Ballum with me. She's with Restored Ministries. I encourage you to check her out. Hashtag Restored Ministries. Ministries. <laughs> and hashtag Live Restored. Yes, absolutely. And um, she has a little snippet from the Word for us today, and I asked her to share it with us. Here you go. Hi, the Lord was showing me in James 1 6 recently. It says, But when you ask, be sure that your faith is in God alone. Do not waver, for a person with a divided loyalties is like an unsettled of the waves that would be crashed around with the wind. So I looked up the word waver to see exactly what exactly was waver speaking so loudly to me. And waver says to go back and forth between your choices and opinions, to be unsteady. And I started thinking, gosh, how many times in a day am I unsteady uh, from emotions? We can go from faith to fear in a split second. We can go from happy to sad, calm to mad, from peace-filled to stressed out, from joy to worry. And then I felt like the Lord was speaking to me. He wants me to be steady. He wants me to stand firm. Good. And so to be steady and stand firm, I can't waver. I can't waver. And then he spoke to my spirit and let me know that the enemy doesn't like a joyful and stable person. So the best weapon I can use to fight off the enemy's attacks that makes me want to waver between my emotions is to remain joyful. Amen. That's a good word. So be sure and look up James 1, 6. Actually, 1, 1, 6, but also if you'll go to 1, 7 and 8 where it talks about being a double minded or a double spirited man unstable in all his or her ways in your journey hey i want to encourage you today there's a lot of emotions going on this is the the time of life where people commit suicide more than any other time of the year so i want to encourage you number one you need to be stable decide how you're going to be in this season if you're in a bad mood, I suggest you get out of the bad mood. If you are grumpy and unhappy and sad, I want to encourage you to get with someone who can encourage you so that you can have joy. Don't allow this whole season to go by and you look back come January, February and see how the whole time of the Christmas time, you hated it. <laughs> you don't have to hate it. You can enjoy it. So I just bless you. Until next time, bye-bye.